Mjolnir, ancient weapon of the mythical Thor. One of the greatest artifacts believed to be forged by dwarves and a marvel sensation. Other than being the famous weapon of an Avenger, how did the Vikings see Mjolnir and its legendary wielder, Thor? First of all, Mjolnir was believed to look much different than it is depicted as now. In Norse myths, Thor's hammer was small with a tiny handle. However, it came with a great power, power that was envied by many. Mjolnir was forged by dwarves in a slightly amusing myth where Loki, who is actually the blood brother of Odin, not Thor, makes a wager with dwarves. He'd originally come to tell them to create new hair for the goddess Sif, Thor's wife, after he had played quite an awful trick on her by cutting off all her famously long golden hair so it could never grow back. But Loki being, well, <laughs> Loki, couldn't help himself and jumped to the chance for a wager. In the wager, if Loki loses, he owes the dwarves his head. The dwarves produce several weapons, including a hammer of pure power for Thor, Mjolnir. When the dwarves win, they demand Loki's head, but he squeezes out of it by saying that he didn't owe them his neck, so technically they couldn't behead him. However, everyone, especially Thor, was very pleased with the outcome. Thor, being the god of thunder and lightning, and a prominent Iser, was one of the most powerful Norse gods and was worshipped very much for it. He was Odin's son, but not Frigg, Odin's wife's. And he's known specifically for being extremely mighty. However, the hammer wasn't completely unmovable to anyone who wasn't worthy. As cool as that is, it was more like the hammer was too heavy and too powerful for really anyone but Thor to pick it up. Even Thor had to wear a special belt and gloves when using Mjolnir. But because worthiness had nothing to do with it, Thor's hammer does get stolen in another hilarious myth. Thor finds his hammer missing and finds out that Thrym, the frost giant, has stolen it and won't return it unless the goddess Freya, twin sister to Frey, the goddess of love, fertility, battle, and death, marries him. When she refuses, Thor is forced to dress in a wedding gown and pretend to be Freya with the help of Loki to get his hammer back from Thrym. Even though he succeeds, it is still one of the most humorous myths of Norse mythology. That and Thor and Loki team up in several myths, and even though Loki is inevitably evil in the end, they are still a somewhat comical duo. Mjolnir's power and significance has been known for centuries, and Thor has become a worldwide phenomenon today. Whether Mjolnir is a weapon of a worthy superhero or powerful Norse myth, it will always be remembered as the weapon of the mighty Thor.